Uh, it's that time again, vlogs. Can't get enough of you. Yeah, I'll take a picture of you if you take a picture of me. Off to Sweden. Here are my Swedish friends. Hey. Hi. This is for Christmas. Hello, me again. Uh, it's that time again, vlogs. Today, Arsenal play Barcelona at the Emirates Stadium in the Champions League. Obviously, a tough, tough, tough game again for us. Uh, we've got a bounce up, uh, back from the weekend um, from the loss of the FA Cup final. But the girls are in a good place. We've had the day off through the day today. We're obviously, waiting for the game tonight. We'll be meeting up soon to have some pre match. Um, I have actually just been putting up my Christmas tree. Yeah, uh, looking forward to the game. What a great occasion at the Emirates Stadium. Um, hopefully we'll get a really big crowd. They can be like our 12th man today. But yeah, really looking forward to it. And yeah, it should be a great spectacle for women's football. Obviously we played Barcelona last time. They absolutely humbled us. They played some amazing football. Currently probably the best team in the world in Europe. Um, so yeah, we're really looking forward to testing ourselves against them, but yeah, we know that it's going to be a um, tough ask, but we hope we can put a good performance in and yeah, show guys and everybody what we're about. Look at this guy just sneaking in. All right, just about to head out uh, to meet the team for pre-match. Yeah, we've got to get some fuel in us to be chasing around them Barcelona players. Nah, Back on the strong? bus from my work, why? We play strong. Uh, just say hi, we play strong and I'll leave you alone. Hi, we play strong. Thank you. Look at that. You, you gorgeous thing. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Can't get enough of you. Can't get enough. Hi. Yes, Molly. Oh, with a foot stop bag, <laughs> ready for the game. Are we not allowed on the pitch? Oh. Yeah, I'll take a picture of you if you take a picture of me. <laughs> Okay, just got back from the game. Um, obviously, thank you to all the Arsenal fans. Amazing, amazing crowd. Um, amazing atmosphere at the Emirates. Um, yeah, tough game. 4-0. Um, some mistakes by us. Um, that gifted them a few goals. And playing a team like Barca, who work class, you don't want to gift them anything. But, yeah, the girls worked hard. They showed character on the pitch. Um, Bass are just a different class. Uh, we couldn't get near them at times. These are the games you want to be playing in. You've got to test yourself against the best. So we will again learn from these games instead of moping on them. And yeah, we'll hopefully come back stronger, ready for the next game, which again in Champions League is next week against Hoffenheim. And we've kind of got to win that one to qualify. So yeah, we've got to concentrate on that and learn from these games. Sweden, here we come. Any off to Sweden. Look. Byron. Ole, ole, ole. Carrie, can you tell me something about Sweden? Oh, um, we're flying to Gothenburg. We've once played there. I think it's a really nice city. And um, yeah, um, we're happy to, to play in Sweden. I'm going to ask the Swedish girls later. Maybe they have some more interesting facts than what Carrie just said. <laughs> So we finally made it to Sweden. First impression, it's dark and cold, but here are my Swedish friends. Hey! Hi! So hopefully they can give us some better facts than Carrie about Göteborg. Um, Sofia, have you been in Göteborg before? And can you, can you tell us something about the city, the people, anything interesting? Yeah, I really love Göteborg because we are playing here a lot with the national team. It's our home ground. Oh, okay. So we are here often. Uh, about Göteborg, I really like the nature, about the, how do you say this, Skärgård. The Shellgott, we like the Shellgott. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's like with the ocean and everything flows here. So, so the scenery. Yeah, is that what, is yeah, the yeah, exactly. is scenery. Yeah. As Swedish people, I would say three facts about Swedish people. Last time Vivi told me three facts about French people. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, they are very <laughs> effective. They like to do things fast. Fast, okay. Yeah. So not wasting any time. That's Don't Swedish? Don't waste any time. That's okay. really Swedish. Uh, they are also very nice. 
Okay. I, yeah, I agree. Swedish yeah. people are super nice. <laughs> and um, very calm, I would say. Calm? Yeah. Okay. They. And <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. That's wrong. That's wrong. Okay. <laughs> I would say calm. I would say calm. Okay, I would say a lot of Swedish people are blonde. That would be my <laughs> first fact. Yeah. So maybe Carrie is Swedish as well? Yeah. She she some yeah. jeans. Some Swedish yeah, jeans. She is Swedish. She is Swedish. In Sweden, we also have really nice coffee. Nice coffee, that's and good. Yeah. Hot, hot chocolate. Yeah. Nice hot nice chocolate. chocolate. Okay, so I'm looking forward to the coffee and hot chocolate. And maybe some more light, because it's, it's <laughs> afternoon and it's already dark. Yeah. So that's yeah. kind of yeah. weird. Hello everyone, it's finally Champions League week again and I'm super excited because we have our last two groups, groups games, group games coming up. Um, the first one is here in Göteborg against Hecken. Um, we made it to Sweden and yeah, so far so good. It just, it's super cold outside. And what's also different is that it's so dark. It's, I think it's three o'clock. And outside you can see already dark so that's something I have to get used to but the games are in the evening anyway so it's fine um, so yeah we just got to the hotel and it was a good good journey here um, easy flight and we have our final training session in the stadium later so I'm excited to see the stadium um, also different because it's on artificial grass so it's a turf grass and not natural grass but I'm pretty sure we will be fine um, so yeah, we are in Sweden, I'm ready for Champions League and it's good to be back vlogging. So we just finished our final training session, um, that's the stadium, I think it's pretty cool, like I mentioned it's artificial grass, so everything is set for a good Champions League game tomorrow, I'm excited and I'm ready to go. Thanks Hamid. What are you doing? Filming. What's that? <laughs> it's for my vlog, yeah it's a video. It's our athletic trainer by the way. We are done with our activation. It's basically the same every away game, so nothing new to see here. But um, yeah, it's always fun to get a little bit started into the day and do some exercises, mobilization and some fun activities. So yeah, I think we are ready, we are prepared and I'm excited for the game tonight. So we decided to go for a little walk because it's nice outside and get some fresh air. And I want to know some Swedish facts from Glow. Three facts about Swedish people since you've played in Sweden for so long. Swedish people love their candy. They so love we're going candy. to a candy store right now. Ooh. Fun fact. Uh, Swedish people are very adventurous. Are they, Hanna? Yes, they are. <laughs> <laughs> and they are pretty close off until you get to know them and then they are the nicest Ooh. people ever. Interesting, <laughs> interesting facts. Are you the nicest person ever, Sophia? I am. She, was, she wasn't very close though. <laughs> <laughs> she was open from the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Candy. The little kid is happy. Oh my god. What? And then, and then enjoy. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ooh, a bucket. Let's start. If we lose, this is for Christmas. This is for Christmas. It's not for actually game no. day people. Let's start. Hmm. So I think we are all happy with our candy. Um, obviously, it's not before the game because yeah, you need to prepare the right way. But sometimes after games, it's okay to eat a little bit of sweet stuff and candy, and yeah, it's just good for your mental health, I would say as well. So. We got our candy for the next few weeks and yeah, I'm excited for the game.
I would say it was a successful game for us. Um, first half we started off a little bit, I don't know, hectic and um, yeah, didn't control the game as much as we would have wanted to. But in the end, second half, um, we played really good. We scored a few goals, so I think it was a well-deserved win. Um, that also means we are through into the quarterfinals, which is awesome. Um, one game left, but yeah, we already made it. Um, so it's super cool. I'm excited for the quarterfinal. It will be a good opponent, um, no matter which team we get. So yeah, that's it from us for this week. Um, I hope you enjoy, uh, enjoyed our vlog. Um, thanks for watching, so don't forget to comment, subscribe and follow and I see you guys next time. Take care, bye bye!